Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to this Let's Play of Fallout New Vegas. So, I've been given a few objectives here. I'm doing the White Glow Society stuff. Last time we uh, tried to get Ted Gunderson back, the, the little kid who's been kidnapped, and it turns out that the White Gloves uh, are a bunch of cannibals. So, um, I think my best option here is to um, get rid of the cook and replace him. Just to get rid of Mortimer, I think that's probably going to be the light side. Well, not maybe not light side. Uh, sorry, I've been playing too much Kotor. Uh, but yeah, that'll be the, the way to gain good karma. So, I think first of all, I'll have to join the White Glove Society in order to get near him. How may I be at so, first, uh, yeah, I would like a sponsor to join the White Glove Society. I found out that this guy uh, is... I think I need mm. to talk to him. You'll have to look elsewhere, I'm afraid. Okay, I guess not. The whole idea of joining the White Glove Society is pure hogwash. You're either in it or you're not. There's no joining. This honorary member nonsense is just something Marjorie contrived because she's so preoccupied with image. But it's only a fad. Once it blows over, the riffraff we've temporarily inducted will be shown the door. So I wouldn't hold out hope if I were you. Okay, um, that actually gave me a little bit of information. Uh, so he's told me that the, I can't remember the name of her, but there's the woman who, if she makes me an honorary member, I might be able to get into the kitchens, replace the gourmet cook, which is very similar to a mission done in Skyrim, actually. And yeah, then we can um, replace the human flesh. Welcome to the Ultra Lux. So let's see if we can do this. Um, I want to join the White Glove Society. Why, yes, of course. The White Glove Society is the most exclusive club in all of New Vegas. Perhaps the entire world. It's only natural that you'd need a sponsor from within the club who can vouch for your good name. Originally, we didn't allow anyone else in, you see. Founding members only. We thought exclusivity would make us the envy of everyone who's anyone. And it has. But then I had the idea to allow honorary members. Lower in status, naturally. But it just makes people want to be us even more. And the right people could certainly do wonders for our image. Celebrities, philanthropists. We want only the very best. I'm afraid you are a relative unknown. Certainly not the caliber of person we would consider for such an honor. Not yet, anyway. If you had more notoriety or clout here on the Strip, things would be different. People need to have heard of you, and you must be well thought of. Okay, um... Interesting. So I need to get a bit of notoriety or clout. The answer is... Okay. Come back then. Okay, that kind of makes some kind of sense. So what she's essentially saying is I need to get a bit of... But what other groups are there on the Strip? Uh, free side I'm accepted, the north side... Okay, yeah, so apparently I'm going to have to do some stuff to become well-liked within the Strip Did you know the strip's in order to get um, into the White Gloves. And from there, Apparently, I'll be able to get into the kitchens. Oh, wait, can I just break in now? Can I just do it now? Because if I can, that will be so much easier. Not going to lie. Um, okay, let's see if we can do, do it that way. Okay, so they can't see me at the minute, which is good. And hopefully, I should be able to just break into the kitchen. Okay, so I got in without any trouble. That's good. And uh, yeah, nice. So I didn't actually need to join their stupid little club. So yeah, find a way to gain access to the members only section. Good stuff. So that, I would guess, is the cook. Um, I don't know. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to quick save here. And let's see if... Uh, so it's just like a standard white glove. Am I allowed to be in here? Let's find out. They've seen me. They don't seem to care that I'm here, so that should be okay. Uh, that's pretty damn cool, actually. That's worthy of a screenshot. Uh, let's put my gun away. And yeah, that's pretty damn cool, actually. Let's get. Yeah, that's the one. That's the one right there. 
that's a screenshot if ever I saw one. Um, okay, so yeah, elevator to the Ultralux kitchen. So I'm planning on replacing the gourmet chef person, but they're all just letting me in here, so they all, I think they all you, just assume. What do you think oh. you're doing? Why do they all sound the same? Um, okay, let's see. Oh, I've got repair. Ah, okay, this could work. Um, water main burst upstairs. They sent me to do a survey to survey the damage. Curse it all. Your timing couldn't be more atrocious. Just make it quick, all right? Nice. Okay. Um, so I'm supposed to go through here, apparently. So I'm actually looking for a gourmet chef. I was given an option to poison some wine. I don't want to do it that way. Actually, I would I would prefer to like replace the human flesh with um... oh let's see iguana bits. Very nice. Yeah, I would I would prefer to replace the chef. Who's this guy? Philly. Okay, so I'm gonna quick save here in case this goes horribly wrong. But the plan here is to kill him. So let's see what we can do. I think we have to kill him. Is that what it said? Yeah, it was quests. Um, get rid of Philippe. Yeah, let's see, see what we can do here. So, let's give him a few headshots. Fact. The silence pistol might be better. They won't hear that. Um, okay, let's see what we can do here. See what we can do now. Okay, that didn't finish him off, actually. And now he's just gonna run away, I think. Uh, so on a shotgun. And, okay. Okay, that's not gonna work. Nice. So, Philippe is dead. Is that, that's what I was meant to do, isn't it? Is that what I was meant to do? Quest complete. Um, I think that's what I was meant to do. It doesn't say optional complete though. And use his recipe. Get rid of Philippe and cook the banquet using his recipe for human flesh. Ah, okay, yeah, yeah, okay, right. So I am doing it right. So what do we do now then? What do we do now? There's a computer terminal here. Let's see what this does. Uh, engage lock. Why would I want to engage lock? Oh no, that'll, that'll... I think the kid is locked in the freezer, so if I engage lock, it should open the door and I can talk to him. There is granted locking. Oh, okay. Okay, so that gives me, like, freedom to do whatever I want now, does it? Let's see if I can find this kid as well. Um, freezer terminal. Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna have to hack into this one. I bet he's behind this door then. So we're gonna get four attempts at this. Um... What? How? Eh? Oh, I must have hit the wrong thing. Sorry, hold on two seconds. I'm gonna quick save. You've lost karma, I know, I know. Uh, and let's see if we can get through this door. In fact, don't I don't I even just have the key? I'm pretty sure I got a key off him. Um, yeah, I did, yeah. Okay, good stuff. And here he is, Ted Gunderson. Let's My talk to you. Kill all you bastards once he finds out what you've done to me. Um, okay, calm down. Uh, I've come to get you out. My daddy sent you? God damn it. I almost died in here. What the hell took you so long? It's just one damn hotel. Who did this to me anyway? They hit me over the head before I got a look at them. Um, okay. Some of the members of the White Glove Society were going to eat you. What in the Sam hell? Eat me? What kind of sick bastards would eat a person? I know, what, right? As soon as I'm out of here... And my daddy knows the story, you can bet there ain't gonna be no white hat society no more. Um, okay, um, the white glove society isn't to blame, just Mortimer and a few others. The hell with that. You've seen those freaks. They dress the same, talk the same. You can bet they all eat the same too. They deserve what my daddy's gonna have coming for them. Um, no, 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 I don't want, I don't. I mean, I do, I... Originally, I liked the idea of massacring a lot of them, but now I want to see if I can, like, turn this to my favour, so, um, I could always leave you here if you're not going to listen. All right, all right. 
but there's gonna be some justice one way or another. I'll see to that. Let's go. I'll be right behind you. Okay, is this the way to do it? Uh, I'm not too sure. I want to do the whole cook the... the um... Let's see. Ah, here we are. Right, good. I don't have survival, so... Let's see. Intelligence of six required to cook the following recipe, which I have. Uh, cook imitation human flesh using recipe. Okay. Is that done? Okay. Use the intercom to call in the head waiter. So, let's try that. Call waiter. How may I assist? Um, time to serve the meal. At once. Cool. I think, like, I don't want to kill them all because I want quests. What is going on here? Open door. Who is this guy? Head waiter. Why is he attacking me? Come on. Oh, is this because I let Ted Gunderson out? Hold on, hold on. I don't want to do it this way if it's gonna, if that's gonna happen. Okay, so I'm going to do this without letting Ted Gunderson out for the time being. Um, just see if it works. I don't want to, like, have everyone killed. Let me serve the meal. I'm gonna put my gun away as well. And, yeah, hopefully they won't kill me, so... Uh, he'll be on his way through any minute now. Uh -oh. Whoa, 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 what is going on here? Why? Why is this happening? Okay, so I discovered something quite cool while I was messing about trying to figure out how to do this quest. Um, I put on this mask and I put on this and yeah so it disguises me as a member of their faction uh, they consider me a friend while enemies of that faction will attack on sight so security personnel such as guards will see through your disguise and alert anyone nearby so watch out but it might give me the opportunity to do this quest properly now so um, we're gonna have to um, get rid of this guy uh, unfortunately, yeah, um, I've had to like reload a couple of times try and figure out how the hell to do this. I'm hoping it's going to work this time. Um, I'm going to leave Ted in there for now uh, and hopefully this will work. So we're going to cook the human flesh and I'm going to alert the head waiter. How may I sit? Um, time to I'll be the ready meal. when you need me. Ah, so the dialogue's different that time, so this time I have to wait until 7 o'clock, so I know I'm doing it right this time. So let's wait a few hours until 7. Uh, well, it's probably going to be 6.54 for 5. Okay, yeah, so one more hour should do it. Cool. So I think I've done it right this time. So it's about 7 o'clock now, uh, 1 minute to 7, so I'm going to call the head waiter. How may I assist? Uh, time to serve the meal. At once. Nice. So hopefully this will work this time, um, and they won't kill me. That's uh, that's the best case scenario here. Veronica's gone. I don't want her messing this up for me. So yeah, let's see if this works properly. So he's going to take the meat, and he's not attacking me, and he's going to serve the meal. Right, that's good. That's really good. So I think, I'm not sure if the next part of this is going to be uh, get Ted and walk in with him. I think that's probably what I'll have to do. I th so I will go talk to Ted and see if, um, hey there. what we can do for him. My daddy's going to kill all you best. Let's see, calm down. I've come and get you out of here. My daddy sent you? God damn it. I almost died in here. What the hell took you so long? It's just one damn hotel. Who did this to me anyway? They um, hit me over the head before. Yeah, I think we saw all this before. Um, there's no time to explain. Some of the men, um, they were going to eat you. What? Okay. And let's see, just Mortimer and a few. And let's see. What? I want to walk into the... Yeah, bring... Um, Mortimer to yeah okay I'm gonna bring Ted to to the meal basically and a quick save what no 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 what that's not supposed to happen um okay I guess we're gonna kill this guy then um 
I don't know why he's wanting to attack me, but whatever. He's wanting to attack Ted for some reason. Uh, we can't have that. Sorry. Nice. Okay, yeah, I think as long as I'm not seen, we should be okay. So, uh, which way do I have to go now then? Um, so there's the wine thing, which I don't need to do. And yeah, I think it's over this way somewhere. If I, if I remember correctly, it should be up here, I think. Because um, I did this a minute ago, but they all decided to kill me. Where is Ted? Okay, yeah, Ted needs to come with me for this. Uh, I'm hoping that this time I've done it right, but let's find out. I know I'm not the scheduled speaker. Here we go, right. Words, if I may. There was a time not so long ago. Okay, so I'm gonna be quiet for a minute and listen to what they're saying. As a clan. Oh come on, really? Who's this? Why is she attacking me? Why why? Stop attacking me. As a society, I don't know why she's attacking me. This doesn't make sense. Okay, we're gonna duck here. Um, okay, so we have to expose Mortimer at the end of the speech, okay. So I need to listen to this guy. As a society, we've endeavored to sample the finest food and drink the world has to offer. But we are living a lie. There is a meat sweeter than the most corn-fed livestock. Most of you have tasted it. All of you have coveted it. Among us... It is a crime to discuss a return to the old ways that unified our people. Tonight, that all changes. The taboo ends. Let me finish, Marjorie. You don't know it yet, but you are all now guilty of a greater crime. One that ordinarily bears the harshest of punishments. Surely that you are all guilty warrants not only universal amnesty, but also a renewed discussion. For our society to be truly elite, we must dine on the most delicious, the most exclusive food known to us. And tonight, for the first time as a society, you are sampling that very dish, the meat we are forbidden to taste, the way it was meant to be eaten. Fellow members of the White Glove Society, bon appetit. Oh no, she's seen me. No, 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 she wasn't supposed to see me. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Load the quick save. This is not going well at all. Fellow members of the White Glove Society, bon appetit. Okay. So, um, is this it? Is this where I expose Ted? Um, I expose Mortimer? Can I just walk out now and be like, hey, guess what? Um, I think that's what I have to do now. And she wants to attack me for some reason. And Mortimer wants to attack me as well. How? Why? Why? Of the White Glove Society. Bon okay, right. So, um, I think that's pretty much it. So, what do I do now then? Quests. Beyond the Beef, expose Ted um, to the members only after he finishes his speech. Okay, I think this is what we do now. So do I have to just go and talk to him quickly or like, what, 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 what do we do now? What the? Who is this trespasser? Um, bad news Mortimer, no one is eating the boy kidnapped tonight. What are you... Why is he there? Who are we eating right now? Um, okay, so, okay. Ah, uh, oh, right, I did it. So, sorry, Mortimer, secret recipe. It isn't human, though, I can tell you that. No, these are lies. I never kidnapped anyone. And even if I did, there's no harm done. He's alive, after all. Uh, too late, Mortimer, you already said too much. You're all hypocrites. How can you claim to be connoisseurs yet deny yourselves the greatest of all meats? I am ashamed to have once called everyone here family. This isn't over, though. I'll begin anew. The White Glove Society will never achieve the greatness of my new order. 
You'll all hear from me again. I'm sure we will. I'm sure we will. So, um, the White Glove Society, do they still want to kill me? Or not? Um, maybe not. I'm a little bit concerned about them seeing me now. Uh, it doesn't look like they want to kill me anymore, which is good. So, yeah, nice. Okay, so can I get them to join me now? Uh, can I join them, rather? Let's talk to you. Life at the top is immensely satisfying. Yeah, I'm sure it is. I'm sure it is. Okay, so, um, I'm going to talk to her. You mustn't ask why we wear our masks. To speak of it. Nice. Okay, this will make a lovely screenshot. Um, and yeah, I think now we will return Ted to his um, to his uh, dad. I think yeah, if we can if we can find a way out of here. Um, now I actually broke into this area. I wasn't really meant to come here originally, so. Let's see if we can find a way out of this bit and uh, return him to his uh, to his father. Yeah, this looks like the way. Yeah, so I, I think it's just a case now of returning um, Ted to his dad. I don't think they'll um, try and get me, attack me or anything anymore. They all seem pretty chill with me now, which is good. Um, and hopefully that'll get them on side. I mean, we got rid of the cannibals within the White Glove Society. I'm guessing there was another way to do this. That is a cool screenshot. I'm guessing there's another way to do this whereby you, um, you know, you side with the cannibals and stuff. I'm, I'm guessing that's probably a thing. But never mind. So I'm going to go see... Um, Ted's father now, if I can find him. I'm not really sure whereabouts he is. I would also like to talk to... Oh, that woman's gone as well. I don't know where she went. I don't think she had anything to do with the cannibalism, though. Um, to be honest, I really don't feel like it was, it was her that was doing it. So, let's see if I can find his dad. Okay, so we made it back to his father. So let's, uh... Hello. Let's see if there's some reunion thing here or... Oh my god. Yep. Ted, are you alright? Quit your hollering. I'm fine. Nice. Okay, I'm gonna talk to Heck Gunderson. You got me my boy back. I got no words. How about now, thank I you? I hope you didn't do no harm to whoever's responsible for this. I want to skin their hides myself. Eh, uh, yeah, it was Mortimer, one of the white gloves who had taken... Uh, Ted, he's a cannibal. Um, yeah. Well, that does it. None of them maniacs will ever do business with Heck Gunderson long as they live. Hell, I'll put me together a damn blockade. Hit them where it hurts. They control the food? Well, there ain't gonna be no food. Not for anybody in this whole damn town. It's a goddamn monument to inhumanity. Let them starve. Biggest favor anyone's ever done this hellhole. I don't think that's fair. Let's not be hasty. You don't have to punish the entire strip. The heck I don't. It's their support that gives these bastards power. They all ought to suffer for what they've done. I just won't be satisfied with anything less. Wouldn't be enough. My mind's made up on this. I'm cutting off the food supply to the strip. They gotta learn their lesson the hard way, looks like. All right. Oh, well, I no. I promised you I'd make it worth your while. Oh, so, no. Try not to lose it all at the same casino. No, no, no. I didn't want that. I didn't want that to happen. Um, I didn't want that to happen. Still putting all my points into medicine. Maybe a little bit into survival. Yeah, I didn't want that to happen like that. Um, huh. Okay, you know what? Well, we'll, um... We'll have a look at the perks and stuff for now and see what else we can get here. So is there any new perks uh, that I can learn? So yeah, we already, so the new ones will be right down the bottom. Um, weapon strength, no, no, no. Having 
a chem resistant perk makes you 50% less likely to develop an addiction. Hmm. No, no. Actually, oh, that could be good. That could be really good, actually. Uh, you gain an extra 15 points to that. That could be useful. That could be really useful. Um, your limbs receive 50% less damage than what they normally would. I think I'll take that, actually. That could be pretty damn cool. Although, although, I might want that. Toughness, yeah. Yeah, increase my damage threshold. That would probably be the best one. Yeah, that'll do me. That'll do nicely. Cool. So, I'm not really sure um, what my actions have led to. I'm not entirely certain. Let's look at the world map. Um, we're still neutral on the strip. I still want to be in the White Glove Society. Just like so I can do quests and stuff for them. But, Hello. Um, yeah, I'm going to head back to see if I can find that woman and try and uh, join the society now. Okay, so I found Marjorie. Um, I also stole, I pickpocketed a secret society member key uh, just so I could like get about places easier. Um, oh, oh I'd like my. to see what How she says about all this. And in front of all these people too. He always was a bit of a pill, Mortimer. He was so pouty when I decided to ban eating people. And now this. I should have paid more attention to the warning signs. Can you imagine what people would have said? Why, it would have been a complete scandal if it weren't for you. Um, okay, so I've got fame with the White Glove Society. Cool. The answer is... Okay, it's still no, um... Okay, that's fine. So, yeah, they... Wait, hold on. Uh, renowned for your extensive support and goodwill as idolized by the community. So, did they like me now? Welcome to the Ultra Luck. Can I do that quest now? The end. Huh. Even though it says I'm idolized, that doesn't really make a whole lot of sense. Uh, let's go back and try again. Welcome to the Ultra Luck. Um... Oh, okay. Well, I guess that's all uh, for today, guys. I'm not really sure how to get missions from these guys, but yeah, it was pretty pretty damn interesting, that whole storyline. There, there must be something I can do to get, you know, missions from these guys, but I just want to thank you all very much for watching. Please like, subscribe, and all that good stuff. Leave any comments if you have any, and I'll see all you guys next time.